Let's make him bigger, motherfucker. Whatever the song was called, I released that shit. I'm talking about motherfucker. Coming up on Montgomery Street. Walking the smooth from AB Hill from Try Me. And I just put that in there, like, and I felt that shit. I used to walk to school by myself. My mom, my grandma came over that one time. She was like, you got to go walk to school? But when you're young, you're invincible. You don't think about that shit. Nigga, you go on, right. you walk the street. Your mama tell you, do this. Go here, go here. Yeah. You're going to do that. Yeah. Now, weirdos might be in the way, but guess what? I'm getting on the bus. I'm still on the AMB. The bus driver know me. Yeah. That's what we got away from that shit. We got away from that shit. We got away from. We got a hell of a story. We got away from kids knowing, man. We can't, we can't even let our kids. And bro, that put me in. That made me think about. We gotta protect our kids. We walked like, through so much shit, but we was only young. Uh-huh. Like mom said, we could, and coming all the way back. Yeah. And it was so much shit that was going around the outside of that bubble that we blocked off. <laughs> like so much shit and phased through that shit. I used to uh, not really know where my grandpa was standing on my, my dad's dad. He used to walk past his house every day because it was right there by the house. And that was, oh! Uh, yeah, I went to I Never used to stop and say anything. Never used to really see the fam because I didn't really know the fam until like one day my dad told me, that, yeah, just took us out. So that was your, da- your, pa- your pop's dad? My pop's dad. Wow. Wow. Mom dad was, that's the other situation. So yeah, yeah, yeah. That I was like, I don't know if the guy did or not. Was he alive the whole time? I could have talked to him. I chalked it to the game now. I'm not, a lot of shit I learned not to be. I learned how to not let me being mad really come into effect. <laughs> so I could be pissed off, but I could be just like this right now. Yeah. Because I, I, like I, I told my, I told my, I told, I told my boy. My bro, yeah. George, I told him earlier, I said, you ain't asked to be here. You can't take on all of the, of the responsibility, remembering the history. Basically, I told him, you can't take on the pain of your previous generation. Like, exactly. you ain't asked to be here, man. Your family is your family. You ain't picked them motherfuckers. You gotta <laughs> deal with them. You gotta fucking deal with them. And there are a lot of people say you Period. don't gotta do it. Yes, you do. That's a you lot. Got to. You, you got to. You got to. If no you, matter what. If you don't talk to that family, guess what? You just made another family. So you still dealing with that family. Because <laughs> you know what? That blood from them niggas is in them niggas. Mm-hmm. So either and way. They're gonna do the same thing. They're gonna do the same thing. You can wonder about, damn, why my daughter do all this? And your cousin, oh, she act just like your own great your mama. Every time. Oh, she act like Aunt Bernice. Aunt Jeanette. Boy, you look just like your daddy. Act just like your dad. I used to get And you think they bullshit. I used to you think it's cause you cause you you're pissed cause you like, man, I don't know what the fuck they talking about. They don't know me. My dad it was this and I like to play video games. And you don't know. Your dad had a fucking guitar and was beast at the game or yeah, beast at pool. See, see a lot of <laughs> it, it copy you sound your voice. Oh yeah, your dad is like music too. Mm-hmm. Why the fuck I like to smoke and drink so much? Oh, yeah, your dad used to do cocaine. So, Bro, okay, I did not. Be, be like, he even went further. Oh, yeah, you like to look up kinds of shit? Your dad is a Freemason. See, yeah. You know what I mean? I don't talk to that nigga. You know, me personally, I don't talk to my pops like that. Yeah, I learned more about the uncle and shit more than my pop. Facts. For real, for real. Mm. At, the, at the time when he was there, which I really could have got information from him. That's about more about the, it, it, that's why I said about like the bubble, bro. You learn. I learned so much about the surroundings mm. instead of running about that line. So when I post a, I post a, I post a song on Facebook talking about a line. That was like niggas gonna get it, but I was like think about it. No niggas don't get what the fuck I be saying. But <laughs> it's yeah. so much I could have just took right there. But hey, uh, I understand that my aunt got me into fucking music. <laughs> <laughs> See, like it's always the other people for some reason. It's always the, you, the, the like cousins, you, just like what you. Your brothers, say. your cousins, our black people, our cousins is usually our closest brothers, and our uncles is usually our closest pops for real. Facts. I'm gonna say that for, for yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah. Seeing the line doesn't just seeing the line doesn't mean you know what's on the other side. Nah, that's a real fact. <laughs> And I was like, bro, that's so much shit. Like, I learned about, yes. I learned about my uncle Reggie, my uncle Sean. Shit, they used to like to do. Da, 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 da. I'm just sitting there chilling at bum house one day. Pops just like, yeah. What y'all in there doing? Playing more combat? Oh, for real? Get the sticks. <laughs> Beat everybody's. I'm like, what? Mm-hmm. You know how to play a game? Yeah. And your favorite character is who? My favorite character? I. Right. Okay, so, oh, you do this? What the fuck? You gotta Yeah, be. your dad did all this. Y'all tell me this and that? Yeah. Uh-huh. Or either you just find out certain shit when you when you literally turn their age. Yeah. That you saw them and recognized them and when you first became conscious of them. Like, damn, I was fucking five years old. My people was fucking 20, however, 20, however. Yeah, yeah. And I remember them smoking cigarettes. I was like, I hated cigarettes. And then you turn 24, you smoking fucking cigarettes. You fucking drinking Henny or whatever the fuck. Preach, you know what I mean? It's, 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 the, the stuff is crazy. Yeah, so really, really, I'm saying the same thing my parents are about to tell y'all. Listen to your fucking mama and daddy. <laughs> Even if they in your life. Yeah. So to all you yeah. niggas and bitches that be like, fuck my mama, fuck my daddy. I'm a hear a nigga to tell y'all I stay with my grandma. I ain't stay with my, I stay with my mama for a couple years. Stay with my daddy for a couple nights one time. Them niggas that be like, fuck their mom and daddy, y'all fucking lying. You fucking lying. You a fucking lie. If they, 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 they want in your life, you know what I mean? Most people have either one or the other. You fucking lying. You either cool with both of them for real in your heart, or you really want to be cool with them. Yeah. And you just, because you just like them. And you're going to find yourself forgiving them whether you want to or not. Sorry. Because you're going to go through the same trial and tribulations. People, people they don't want to accept that. Yeah. All that negative shit that happened in your life was for the reason for you to become now you are now. Boom. So by you saying, "Oh fuck, that person here never was in my life," so you telling me you be where you at if it was. Boom. Let's go back to that. <laughs> Nick, oh shit, what? The, oh, I'm in this situation. Oh no. All right, you gotta accept shit. You gotta accept it. Man. I said my pops died early it's because it was supposed to happen. Was supposed I accept to. that. That might hey. We ain't gonna get too deep on it, but hey, certain things is. It was to certain things. That's why, like, when I found out about shit that happened before you passed, I, thought, I was like, "Damn, this could happen." Anyway. Then, I, first I had boo butt. I was like, "Damn, I wouldn't have met Keisha. I wouldn't have had boo butt. If they if we would survive, they would have got married. Cause I probably wouldn't have been out here. Mm-hmm. He probably would have helped me push for a football career or something more harder. Now I probably been college and state or, or living somewhere else. Yeah. And that, that would have took the joy of my daughter away from me. No, that's what I'm like. That's why I'm like, bro, shit, you got to start accepting shit. It's easier to say that now at the age of 30 yeah. than I was at 21. <laughs> we wish we could catch it. That's what, every, yeah. <laughs> that's what everything, everybody wish they could do every generation. We wish we could catch it. And then we try to catch it. Some of us wise when we're young and we catch a bit of it, but we never really catch all of it. Right. Then when we have kids... Or nieces and nephews, we try to like. I'm gonna give them. The, we try to. I'm gonna give them cheat codes. Just like, and it don't work, brother. It's the same cycle. Yeah, but you, that man. don't mean you ain't supposed to try. That, yeah. That's the whole point. It don't mean you're not supposed to I still see why keep they were going. Trying to give us the games right back then. We it's were like, nah. Still, I felt like I played on hard by my damn self. Yeah, it's, you understand it. You really still supposed to look. They, you understand they go play on hard, but you still try to give them cheat codes. That's one I talked about. That's the cycle. That's love. Talked to Booba <laughs> earlier today. I'm like, why the fuck was you crying? Uh, da, da, da. Keisha was saying something about it. Like, she was like, nah, I won't cry. My nose bleeding. Da, 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 da. Mm. Then she was like, finally broke down. So, boy, tell me anything. Well, I, you're not staying here with me. Well, what else? Mm-hmm. The family. So I told her, I'm like, look, you have two houses. I said, like, I'm going to get my own. But it's something with me and your mama that's not gelling. And I can't keep doing it. But I said, don't ever think. Yeah. That your daddy is gone. Mm-hmm. Like I don't know which. Like I could, I could just bad talk Keisha the whole time or did something like that. Like in my head was thinking, damn, this bitch saying something to him. <laughs> but I'm like, nah, kids be older me stuff now. On yeah, they do. They older, they older me, like me, 25. I would say, what the fuck your mama saying to? Yeah. Me now, nah. I'm like, look, don't even think like that. 
I see you bugging. I see you when I see you. I said, bro, well, I'm getting my shit straight. It's not the fact that I don't want to stay there. Because she was thinking, I'd rather go stay with her auntie. Instead of staying there. Yeah, I said, yeah. no, I'm not trying to stay with your auntie either. Right. Your daddy trying to make moves. Yeah. Like, that's what I got to do. And uh, plus, I feel like I, I got unplugged from that situation to start making moves. Instead of me waiting so long to do shit, you're, I'm ripping shit off like a band-aid nowadays. Mm, just I'm only quick, getting older. Quick heal. I'm only, like, it, yeah. When you tired of beating that butch, and you say, like, no, I'm just going to chop it down. Yeah. You've been beating that butch for 20 years, blocking your view. And you finally decided to chop it down. Like, I'm tired of waiting for shit. Like, that's what like, we were talking about. We, it started with, like, we were talking about, the, like, getting the camera. I want to do this. I want to do that. It started with me just saying, you know what? Grandma was right. And just like, just to your point, she gave you the mm-hmm. cheat code a long time ago. Long like, I pay attention. Ago. I need to execute Man. and pass it on. That's the only way I can do now. Access the information and pass the shit on, man. So, like, tell me what, what you want to do. Mm. Oh, I like to do dancing. Don't tell me do it. Right, yeah. If you really want to do dancing, I'm going to find this joint. Because I'm your parent, yeah, I'm supposed to. But don't say you want to do it. And when I get you to that step, uh, change your mind. This is what you want to do. Yeah. I'm about to put everything. I don't care if I'm late or I can get the money or I got to put my last on it. Don't bullshit. I'm going to do it for you. Spend your, don't bullshit. Spend your time on what you love. Exactly. Yeah. Everybody was raised that. I really, I feel like sometimes it won't dare for me. But then again, at me at an older age, I'm thinking, yeah, it was. I just ain't take good advantage of it like I should. Mm-hmm. That's a hardcore. That's hardcore. <laughs> That's a hardcore uh, uh Realization, epiphany, man. Yeah, because you think about it. Oh, man, I could have been in the league. I could have this. And when you actually say, this is my fault. Yeah, I bullshit. I dropped the ball. I man. bullshit. Yeah. Because I said, I talked to a bunch of hack niggas in um, like 12th and 11th graders in football, about football. When I used to walk over from 8th grade, and they were like, man, niggas don't even play for real. I'm like, man, I'm not about to play with niggas I ain't trying to play for real. Mm-hmm. Instead of me executing I the same what I, I wanted to do, I let somebody else take me out of the game. I'm not trying to go I back I take out. it back. I let myself take me out of the game. Yeah. You got you to gotta accept your own bullshit. I did the same thing. I went back I went back and tried 10th grade. You know, I started drinking water, hella water and everything 10th grade. Working out with, uh, um, damn. Fucking uh, I want to call him. Why? Why? You broke some people. Butch in them, you? Nah, Butch won't there. Butch ain't come there okay, till he ain't, he ain't come. He said I ain't been there. Oh, no, no, I ain't been there to County Fair. Fucking yeah. Mike Chat came a little later. Before Mike Chat was there, Peasy. Now what was his name though? He got the nigga one best dress. He graduated with us. But fuck, like some nigga niggas won't know. He was a, he was D, he was D lineman. Um, I don't remember his name later on. But I worked out with that nigga. He was there from the beginning. This was like probably when she was in school. It was over in June, July. So I'm going to say probably for June. I tried to go out 10th grade. I played in fucking elementary to 5th grade. Anyway, so 10th grade, I'm going to drink hell of water. Let me, let me go. I'm losing weight. Work out. Nigga throwing up. Ugh. I'm running up the bench. I love football. Fast forward. Nigga start, you know, going to county fair season. I dropped the fuck out. Fuck it. You know what I mean? Only was I dropped out because I said, yo, these niggas, that nigga, the nigga I was working out with, long story should have told me, these niggas are not serious as you. And the spots are already taken as Facts. far as who, who's gonna play. Yeah, yeah. Now to go back to your point of me still dropping the ball, like, oh how you dropped the ball, niggas was but, but I still could have chosen to pursue that and take them nigga spots. You accept your realization? I could have took them nigga spots. I didn't want to do it. <laughs> That's the point. So, motherfuckers love some shit. I had a cheat code. We just want to execute them. You, you had time. But guess what? And you can't cry about it now. You can't cry about it now. You got to so move why? on. Yeah, I loved it. And I also let it down. I also exactly. dropped it. But guess what? I don't give a fuck. I mean, I do, but I got, that's just long story short. I think about you it. You accept it. You gotta accept it, exactly. You so, I don't give a fuck is equivalent to. It's di- It's a different story. If we have the technology to have the time machine to go back 
and do shit different. But that's bullshit. It's Facts. not real. You're not going back in time. Facts. That's gonna be happening. It's gonna be like four generations. I'm gonna be been dead. Facts. Back, ta- <laughs> back taxes of niggas trying to shit. go back in time. That's what I'm saying. Like shit. So, so but I mean, you gotta accept when you look at yourself like I dropped the ball. Yeah. So that, I understand that shit, man. The, I, we, we, we try to pass it on to them niggas. Yeah, that's the only thing we can do. Pass that's the only thing. That's the only thing we can do. Just don't don't try to live in the fucking past. Move fucking forward as fast as you can. We gonna try to live in the past. That's our natural shit. Fact. But just go ahead yeah, and move. Yeah, <laughs> just, just yeah, just go ahead and move on. That's what I uh, where, where, where I'm at right now. My ignorant dumbness, sophomore years of my life. The the wise food being thirty. To me, that's what thirty is. Wise food. You just getting out great. Yeah. Like, yeah. Wise food. Sophomore <laughs> season. It's we okay. Just, we just we just really understand. But yeah. I we I still feel like we're a lot more advanced than some people, but I can't say we're advanced than we're taking advanced classes, everybody. but we still yeah. we still dumb as fuck. <laughs> we got a few advanced AP classes. You got, you got to <laughs> say about life, but you gotta enjoy your dumb ass shit. <laughs> when it's gone, it's gone. When it's gone, it's gone. I wish I'd have been a little bit more dumb. For real, for real. That's why I was. That's my. That's my only regret. I should have been a little bit more dumb. I should have been more safe. I ain't. <laughs> I said, nah. I fully admit to a lot of my shit. I don't give a damn. Like I don't give a fuck who heard it. I hope. <laughs> I hope you take it to the grave, man. <laughs> <laughs> I should have been a lot more safe. I should have been a lot. Hey. A lot of shit. I stuck my neck out and did dumb shit that I should not did. Like, and it fucked me. Yeah. But when it fucked me. I still had to. You still put your heart into it. You feel me? Yeah. You put your heart into it, and you. It's like somebody raping you, but you walk past a guy, uh, you stay with a person, right? All your life. Yeah, that's loyalty. (laughs) Cause you really meant what you did. You really meant the chance. You really meant the sticking your neck up. So that's what I said a lot of times. I wish I was like new. Like we were in that note button back in the day. I should have used the shit. Yeah. Bro, I take it back. I didn't. <laughs> God did a lot of dumb shit. That I was like, bro. And we yeah. can go down a list. I just so, say that. So the hey. ultimate nope champion is motherfucking Terrence. <sighs> yeah. The fucking nope champion. Motherfucker stayed in the house, played this game, and motherfucker literally nope everything. Nope the bitches. You know what I mean? No, no drugs. No drugs. It, no, you know, he tried the bitches and he all that. Drugs. He tried, tried to vape at one point. Listen, man. He tried to vape. Had to vape, hit the blunt. He was like, I ain't get high. He motherfucking drunk. Got so drunk as a bitch. Drunk as a fuck. He said, never again. He never again got that drunk. <laughs> Literally. Literally, never got that drunk. He said, I'm never getting that drug again. He Couple four locos. He was like, drunk TJ, am I cool? You the coolest, man. I can't even. Hey, bro. He crossed the line. Like you said, hey, motherfucker, he crossed that line, man. He saw the line, he crossed it, and he was like, you know what? Fuck that. (laughs) He got smacked. He fucking got smacked. He got smacked. Bro, he woke up, he was like, I don't want to eat shit. (laughs) See, I ain't trying to reveal too much on that. We got to say this for most of the podcast. Yeah, we definitely do. We definitely That's another podcast. Yeah. He definitely. (laughs) I was like, bro, you got to eat to get better. Nah, I ain't nothing, man. Take it, eat it, fuck it. This, oh my gosh. Everybody. Especially, oh yeah, we definitely gonna do a podcast. <laughs> I gotta talk about Josh. Oh, man. I no. gotta talk about Josh. Uh, I, I'm gonna make sure I take that bitch in. Wrestling alone. That's gonna be a wrestling <laughs> thing podcast. But it's gonna, be more, it's gonna be more than wrestling, but. The podcast gonna be so deep, I'm like, yo, people don't know how much wrestling means. <laughs> As First, you gotta develop the philosophy. First, then the wrestling shit comes second. Then they go back to the philosophy, which is crazy. But it's, the, it's, it's, it's when the, you if you not an artist and you can't sell beauty and art, shut the fuck up and turn, turn it over now. Because it. <laughs> like, oh my god, yeah, that shit we meant something. We yeah. used to go do yeah. it. Yep, yeah. yep. Yeah. Yeah. Def- definitely prepare us for the COVID nineteen. Uh, <laughs> Body slam rape party. That's going. That's going on, right? Cause you know what the Rona going on. I don't know how this going. Everybody's saying that right now. 
We prepared for that shit Cause we been had Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches And cereal the in the Same dumb motherfuckers The same motherfuckers At Walmart 24 hours <laughs> <laughs> With Corona Corona Where you going to Walmart Yeah Bad right. stupid shit Incense at Walmart <laughs> Dumb motherfucker what? Like, tissue. So people, tissue That would make it so funny They brought all the tissue And nobody can never get you answer why they brought Why, why the tissue was so much good Hey This is the perfect time For the conspiracy theories To come out and be like See I fucking told you <laughs> Actors buying tissue Cause the corporations I accept anything Cause we, nobody knows I asked my no boss what? My boss doesn't know And I work in retail but one day we're gonna go back and read our old posts from like three years ago. And I guarantee our old posts will predict the future by a couple of seconds. Hell yeah! We, we said it. I'm speechless as a motherfucker. Like, it was a lot of shit. You go back and read that you wrote. Like, that would, that would make, that would hit it. That would, that would, that would smack it. I said that? Yep, yep. Hey, Grandma did say his repeat it, it, it pisses you off. It fucking pisses you off. Oh my. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that's all she wrote. Fuck you, motherfuckers. You know what I mean? Hope y'all learned something. Go home, eat a dick. You know what I mean? Hope we hope y'all. Matter of fact, we hope we made y'all fucking ignorant as a bitch. Matter of fact, cause that's the only way y'all gonna be saved is motherfucker to dive into the ignorance and fucking accept it. You stupid motherfuckers. Fuck you. BBW bitch. Shit. <laughs>